Welcome back students to our online platform that is schools YouTube channel. So again we are ready with today's video. This video is for class 10 and the subject is math and we are dealing with chapter 2 and the name of the chapter is polynomials. So one question is already written on the board that uh, the alpha and beta are the zeros of the quadratic polynomial which is given to us that is Px x square minus 2x plus 3. Now this polynomial is given, the zeros are alpha and beta. Now using that, we are supposed to find one more quadratic polynomial whose roots are alpha plus 2 and beta plus 2. The given equation is the zeros are alpha and beta. And here we have to find out that the quadratic polynomial is the roots of the zeros are alpha plus 2 and beta plus 2. So, First of all, we will use uh, the information given there that is the alpha plus beta will be equals to minus b upon a minus b upon a that is minus minus 2 upon 1 that is plus 2 the first thing is that alpha plus beta is plus 2 at the same time alpha beta will be equals to c upon a that is 3 upon 1 that is 3 so we can write in u so that it is visible properly b is the coefficient of x and a is the coefficient of x square and c is the constant term as we can uh, compare with the general form that is ax square plus bx plus c where a is the coefficient of x square b is the coefficient of x and c is the constant term so we got the sum of the roots and product of the roots of the given polynomial but now we are supposed to find the sum of the roots of the polynomial which we are supposed to be concept jo hame concept karna hai uske zeros ka sum kya hoga that is sum s stand for sum and that will be alpha plus 2 plus beta plus alpha plus 2 plus beta plus 2 that we can uh, manage uh, we can reshuffle that that alpha plus beta plus 2 plus 2 that is 4 so we know the value of alpha plus beta alpha plus beta alpha plus beta is 2 so that is 2 plus 4 that is 6 so jo hame equation banani hai uska sum of the roots kitna hoga 6 at the same time the product of the roots that will be alpha plus 2, 1 0 hai amara, 2 sa 0 amara, beta plus 2 hai, then we are supposed to solve that uh, product. So, we will, first of all, we will multiply by alpha, then we will multiply by 2. Alpha into beta, alpha beta, plus alpha into 2, 2 alpha, plus 2 into beta, 2 beta, plus 2 to the 4. So, we can again, uh, reshuffle that at alpha beta plus so 2 is common from here and here so we can take out 2 and if we take out 2 then there will be alpha plus beta only. alpha plus beta plus 4 so now we can substitute the value how to substitute the value alpha beta we know the value of alpha beta is 3 plus 2 into alpha plus beta alpha plus beta is 2 plus 4 means 3 plus 4 plus 4 means 11 so now we have to construct the polynomial which uh, is required here having the zero alpha plus 2 and beta plus 2 the general form will be that we can take the gx g of x is equals to k k is a constant non zero real number then in the bracket we are supposed to write that x square minus sx plus p s stands for sum of the uh, root uh, sum of the zeros and p stands for product of the zero so that will be k and inside x square minus sum means minus 6 minus 6x plus product product is 11 that is the answer of this question so and the 
आंसर इज सेम दैट इज एक्स स्क्वायर के इंटू एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस सिक्स एक्स प्लस इलेवन सो दिस इज द फर्स्ट पार्ट इन विच दैट द पोलम इज गिवन एंड अल्फा बीटा आर द जीरो वी आर सपोज टू कंसेप्ट वन मोर क्वाड्रेटिक पोलोमिल हैविंग द जीरोज एल्फा प्लस टू एंड बीटा प्लस टू नाउ वन मोर एडिशनल पार्ट इज देयर इन द सेम क्वेश्चन वी शुड डिस्कस दैट एट द सेम टाइम दिस इज रिक्वायर्ड नाउ वी आर सपोज टू कंसेप्ट वन मोर क्वाड्रेटिक पोलोमिल बट द जीरोज विल बी डिफरेंट नाउ द जीरोज आर एल्फा माइनस वन अपॉन एल्फा प्लस वन एंड बीटा माइनस वन अपॉन बीटा प्लस वन बी जाता जीरो ऑफ द इक्वेशन टू बी कंस्ट्रक्टेड सो हाउ टू डू दैट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव टू फाइंड द सम ऑफ द जीरो of the quadratic polynomial uh, polynomial which we want to construct so the sum s will be equals to b is the zero so we are supposed to add then that is alpha minus 1 upon alpha plus 1 plus beta minus 1 upon beta plus 1 so the lcm will be alpha plus 1 into beta plus 1 and the upper part will come multiply by alpha first of all then minus 1 here by beta and then minus so alpha into beta alpha beta alpha into 1 alpha minus beta plus minus minus 1 plus beta into alpha alpha beta plus beta minus alpha minus 1 upon alpha into beta alpha beta plus alpha plus beta plus 1 from here we are seeing that is plus alpha that is cancel by minus alpha that is minus beta is cancel by plus beta and we are supposed to rearrange that alpha beta plus alpha beta to alpha beta and then minus 1 minus 1 minus 2 upon alpha beta substitute the values of alpha beta and alpha plus beta so 2 into 2 into alpha beta alpha beta is 3 2 into 3 minus 2 upon alpha beta that is 3 plus alpha plus beta 2 plus 1 that is 3 to the 6 minus 2 upon 3 to 5 plus 1 that is 6 so it comes 4 upon 6 that is 2 upon 3 so we got the sum of the zeros of the polynomial which we are planning to construct this is the sum of the zeros that is 2 upon 3 now we are supposed to find out the product of the roots or product of the zeros of the equation to be constructed and the zeros are alpha minus 1 upon alpha plus 1 into beta minus 1 upon beta plus 1 these are the zeros and we are supposed to find the product so we will multiply them so we can multiply easily alpha into beta that is alpha beta alpha into minus 1 minus alpha minus 1 into beta minus beta Minus one into minus one plus one upon on the uh, downward side again we have to multiply alpha into beta that is alpha beta plus alpha plus beta plus one from here we can see that upside the alpha beta is there minus sign we can take common from here minus then alpha plus beta we are taking sign minus sign common from these two only then 
प्लस वन इज विनेरी अपॉन बेल एल्फा बीटा प्लस एल्फा प्लस बीटा प्लस वन नाउ वी आर सपोज सब्सिट्यूट द वैल्यूज एल्फा बीटा दैट इज थ्री माइनस एल्फा प्लस बीटा दैट इज टू प्लस वन अपॉन एल्फा बीटा अगेन थ्री प्लस एल्फा प्लस बीटा दैट इज टू प्लस वन तो इट बिकम्स थ्री माइनस टू दैट इज वन वन प्लस वन दैट इज टू अपॉन थ्री प्लस टू फाइव फाइव प्लस वन सिक्स तो इट बिकम्स वन अपॉन थ्री लाइक दिस so that is 1 upon 3 so we got the sum of the zeros as well as the product of the zeros now we can construct uh, the equation which we are supposed to uh, construct according to the question that is g of x and that will be equals to k the constant will be there and the uh, general form is uh, that is x square minus sum of the rows into x plus product of the Root or the zero. You are not supposed to be confused uh, in between the zero and the root. The meaning is same. So that is k into x square minus sum of the roots. Sum of the roots is two upon three. So minus two upon three x plus product of the roots. That is one upon three, and that is the answer of this question. I think I hope that you have understood. the relationship between the zeros and the coefficients of the polynomials given so you are supposed to go through or you are supposed to try this question again systematically in your rough notebook at the same time uh, you can proceed the questions given in the exercise provided within your ncert book and uh, if you have not arranged the books till now that you are supposed to arrange them within a day or two because now you are seeing that we are proceeding according to the uh, books only so i hope that you will complete and the uh, homework on the daily basis and afterwards you are supposed to take the pick of that and you are supposed to upload on the school's whatsapp number thank you thank you very much